Senna. Pals. So bold. Go away, Javi Koe. This isn't your show anymore. He's trying to flex over <laughs> and show off his abs. He drew on with a Sharpie. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! He got roasted! Poor guy! He's not even here! Oh my goodness! Kristen! Can you please post that photo for me now? <laughs> Blow it up! Kristen! What did okay. I say? Hi everyone, we're back! The girls are back taking over the channel. Um, yes. <laughs> There's a God of War DLC, God of War Ragnarok Valhalla. We did God of War Ragnarok uh, around before the holidays, around the holidays. You know, it was a time things got busy and now we're back. And so we're going to continue on with this one. Hopefully I've picked the right one. This one's from Gamer's Little Playground. It's in 60 frames per second. You can watch this this in 60 frames per second. Yeah, I'm very excited actually to I get feel like this. I feel like no matter what we do at this point, it's never going to be the right one. It's all wrong. It's always wrong. <laughs> Everything's wrong, you guys. I'm just, you know, I'm just going to call it out as it is. It's probably wrong. It's probably wrong. This so isn't the one. We apologize in advance. That it, this is the wrong one. But hope you have a good time nonetheless. Yeah. So before we jump in, please subscribe, click the bell icon, all notifications, and upvote this video. One and a half hours. Guys, grab a snack. Strap in. Let's go. <laughs> I like the throne in the, wa in the water. I don't know. It seems kind of sad to me. <laughs> oh, really? Like, it's like a sad throne. Like it shouldn't be there. Meow. I kind of like it. You are certain you remember nothing of this place? Oh, nothing that would help us. Mimir. <laughs> You're not answering Tell the question. Me, Bella, why exactly are we doing this? Hmm. Ooh. I do not know. Oh. That's comforting. Mm. Look, I know you expect more from the smartest man alive, but Odin always kept me in the dark about this place. Mm. Which is why I urged you to seek Freya's guidance. Repeatedly. She does not seem eager to speak with me. Oh. Quite the opposite, brother. But you tell yourself whatever you need to. Or maybe he doesn't want to talk to her. Mm. I'm not going to say what I think. I get crucified every time I speak. Exactly <laughs> described in the invitation. <laughs> Finally bloody made it. <laughs> what, what do you think? <sighs> Was uh, it really bad? No. Okay. No. It's not even worth <laughs> Now everyone wants to know. <laughs> Good. You know what? Next time you tell me to shut up. <laughs> 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 That's my pettiness. <laughs> Come on now. Something is happening. Cause I don't. Uh oh. Oh. This place isn't that good. Back to basics then. Maybe well, he just lost. Valhalla. Life. I thought Valhalla was Viking heaven. So like, maybe you have to be dead. Well, that felt unsettling. <laughs> like we plunged into a dream. Doesn't seem anyone's here to welcome us. Hmm. It seems quite ominous. <laughs> Locked. I don't suppose you'll take that as our cue to turn around and leave? <laughs> Absolutely not. Let's find a key. <laughs> Where are the CL4? See new how to. Oh, he can read now. He one's own master. Master. His son taught him that. A more poetic mm. way of putting it, but yes. That's a lifelong journey, mastering yourself. Mm-hmm. I think most people don't even really get to achieve that. Oh, he's like, keys? Optional. I just use my strength. Here we go, dream world. Maybe not. Something is wrong. I feel... Oh. Valhalla may not appreciate our breaking in. Yeah. Uh oh. That's not I good wonder if that like affects your fighting, fighting as well in the game. Oh, no shields. Oh. 
Bruin. Not the sort of foes I expected to encounter here. Curious. What did you expect, Mimir? Perhaps the last remaining pocket of Asgard. Nothing unreal about it, though. At least this part seems peaceful. We should have a look around. Maybe Open it's like chest. a memory of Mutual Asgard. Freya would have aided us in this. Aided us? Talk sense into you? Win-win either way, really? I certainly can't see how there's any benefit to avoiding her. I am not avoiding her. Mm -hmm. Mother, you've got the bloody Valhalla to avoid her. <laughs> At least be honest with yourself. Yeah. It is not her I'm avoiding. I value Freya. Aww. Well, that I believe. So, does that mean hear you, admit, frankly, you love her? Yeah, I that's what I'm thinking. she values you as well. In her way? In her way? <laughs> It is not the same. Is that really what you think? <laughs> he doesn't want her to get in trouble. I she understands what she asks of me. Oh. I don't know. She's a pretty wise woman. She is, for the most part. When she's not emotionally damaged. Yes. <laughs> Which is probably most women, to be fair. She's on it. Well, normally she's really, she's been level-headed until, you know, wiped out her son. Her yeah. Son. <laughs> Which, honestly, it looks like, as a mother, yeah. you probably would. Whoa. Oh! Did we die? What? We're back outside. Oh. Oh! You marched into Valhalla without even talking to us first? Whoopsie. Nice to see you too, milady. <laughs> it was a personal matter, and I would not take you from your duties. You breached. Valhalla, consider it worth my time. Ooh. This entrance is secret. Who told you of this place? Mimir. <laughs> Nailed to a door oh. three days ago. <clears throat> Maybe it's Freighters a trap. Of Sparta, you are hereby invited to a challenge. Mm. Face the past, face the future. Master Valhalla, master thyself. Mm. And then directions here. No signature. That's Who else us. knows of this entrance? Odin and us. It's Ooh. likely a trap. That's that's what I'm saying. You're thinking of going back in. Mm-hmm. Would you join me? Oh. Oh. Don't let me intrude on your personal matter. Hmm? Besides, I can't. Unlike the two of you, I've never died. Um. Oh, okay. What happens if I return inside? Well, that depends on you. Valhalla draws from the memories of those who enter. In there, you're an open book. Sure, you want to go back in. Mm. Mm. How did you even get past the gate? Ah. I forced it open. With his bare hands. <sighs> of course. I forced it open. There was like a There's button on the side. Way if you insist on going back in. <laughs> Come. Sigrun, maybe later we could continue with that one conversation there. You know, the sexy Once, ones. Mimir. Oh no. I think you've said enough. Ah. Right then. Just like take him back. <laughs> he got shut down. And the other matter we discussed? You're still thinking, I take it? I am. Hmm. Is that what this is? We're thinking. I just need some time. Give him some time. Guess I'll let you think. <clears throat> yeah, give the man his space. Tell me more! <laughs> Over these secrets. <laughs> Strong and silent like type. You. Let's send you in He's like, kind of gave me the beast vibes. First, <laughs> yeah. Valhalla requires you to perform the ritual of selection. <clears throat> what does that mean? Maybe this time because he does it right. Maybe they won't attack him. Oh, he didn't have a shield before. Oh, so you mm. get to, like, choose your weapon. Your weapons. That's cool. Ooh. Okay, we're going for a balance. Now, let my thing. sister speak to you of Valhalla's rules and its values. Okay. <laughs> Tell me. What do you know of this place? Valhalla seeks to foster wholeness and balance within those who enter. 
To fully master yourself, you can't rely on only your most familiar tactics. Mm. I use the tactics appropriate to the situation. Of course. But varying your approach will demonstrate to Valhalla the full mastery of your abilities. Huh. And Valhalla will reward such demonstrations. Be sure to come back and see me as you progress. Mm. Okay. What have you to say? Hmm. The challenge of Valhalla is not merely about overcoming obstacles. It's about the way you overcome them, how you demonstrate mastery of your own powers. We can guide you down a path, but Valhalla will be the judge of your progress. Return to me when you've met a goal, and we will observe the effects. Hmm. Okay. Step up to the gate when you're ready I to proceed. I am ready. Air, Gunnar, with me. So They're we gotta so be clever. Cool. Yeah, you gotta do different May skills. Fly, oh. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Just sing the door open. That's where you went wrong. Lay <laughs> Come on, sing it. Lay fall. Lay Thank you, Sigrun. Hmm. Bye, boo. Any cursed feeling this time? No. All is well. Thank you, shield maidens. Uh-oh. Right? Let's try this whole thing again. Ah. Full strength, full power. Take that. You. Amir, what is that odds between you and Sigrun? Yeah. Who did you anger her? I wouldn't say she's angry with me. Irritated, perhaps. Disappointed. You're certainly. a delusional Mimir. Oh, well, you needn't worry yourself, brother. She's angry. She <laughs> said disappointed, certainly. <laughs> so, this is no piece of Asgard at all. Just something spun from your memory of it. Fascinating. <laughs> brother, I must admit. Freya's idea does make quite a bit of sense to me. <clears throat> what better god of war could the realms ask for than a general who won Ragnarok and won it trying to save lives? With you on board, our whole peacekeeping council could really do uh. some good. This position, this title, I have held it before. I want none of happened. it. She knows what happened. Of course we do. But why should who you used to be matter more than who you are? Exactly, now? Mimir. That's very Can wise. You see how far you have come. However far I have come, I have done it running from that life, that title, that throne. Aye. Maybe he needs to embrace the throne and embrace the responsibility that comes with it. You know, like how we saw the throne at the beginning. Mm -hmm. I suppose this is about how you remember your name, eh? I do agree with you about Freya's counsel. Mm. It is a noble idea. It should succeed on her merits. How is that, brother? Freya is known to the realms and native to them, respected by all, an experienced leader. Experienced enough to know that a shared power is best for the people. That she would share power proves she is worthy to wield it. Mm -hmm. Even so, why make her wield it alone? Yeah. Without Odin, the realms have a chance to forge a new peace. When conflicts do arise and can't be talked through, a god of war ensures those conflicts have rules and enforces them. They need might and judgment and credibility across the realms. Who else would she pick, brother? Yeah, you're obviously True. the best choice. I'd want him on my side. And this must be how you remember Sparklefight. Hmm. Freya knows I would not refuse to aid her when in need. I have done and will do my part to fight for peace, regardless of title, mm. regardless of whether I sit in authority. Mm. You know as well as I do, there's power in words, oaths. Mm. The people True. need to know you're committed to them and to yourself. True. That you'll be there for them, and I know that you will. I understand you've got misgivings, man, but you've put your past behind you. We all see it. You do not know everything that I am. That you were. 
You've told me of your past, and yes, much of it was horrible. <laughs> But you've proven over and over again that you're not that man anymore. Yeah. There. That is the path we seek. I feel like at a some point and forward. you just have to let go. Mm -hmm. Right? Of like I can feel it. All the stuff that you thought you were or that you were. Well, yeah. Because you're a different person every day. Again. You're already more your cheery self than I've seen in moons. <laughs> Without a trace or a fight in front of you, I wonder after your well being. Combat can be terrifying. Combat is meditation for him. What is this? The throne. You recognize your old seat, don't you? Oh. <laughs> Challenge. Kratos. I have not forgotten the debt I owe. What? Do you really think you understand? This still feels reckless. What? Here they are. That's odd. We're back outside, but we didn't, you know. Sometimes you reach as far as you're ready to go. Oh. Valhalla's decision or yours? Hmm. Does this mean you're done in there? No. no. I will discover who invited me. I believe I am close. You're sure it's worth dying for? Oh, I think we're fairly accustomed to dying at this it's point. It's true. And he always comes Don't back to glib. life. <sighs> Valhalla restores you after honorable death in combat, but beyond that, it makes its own rules. And if you don't play by them, Kratos, the threat of death in there is real. That is good to know. <laughs> If by good, you mean wildly disconcerting. Yes. I do wish you luck. Truly. Hmm. It's own game. I know it. Thank Brother, you. A new way to bargain with Valhalla itself. So you just have to keep coming back. Mm-hmm. And figuring many, it out. How many times do you get, though? That's interesting, statue. Look, brother, the fog's lifted. Valhalla's becoming more open to you, perhaps. Huh. So much to see in the distance there. You can see how all the little realm spaces connect to the higher plane. And those statues are certainly imposing. Yeah. I recognize them. Are they Greek? They are judges of the underworld from my homeland. Ah, well, you That's sound odd. thrilled to see them again. Souls they deemed righteous were granted entrance to the Elysium Fields. Those deemed wicked were cast into Tartarus. Ah, yes, where the souls of the damned were tortured. Mm -hmm. Why has your mind manifested them here, I wonder? Because he wants to be judged, maybe? Wait on See the merits of worthy. his life? Yeah. Worthy enough to take Freya's ah, offer? Midgard in memoriam. Ah, I'm starting to see there's no fixed order to the realms we'll visit here. Brother, whose voice was that we heard when Valhalla sent us back from the throne? Yeah. You heard it also. Aye. Said he owes you a debt, was it? Someone who might lend us a hand, perhaps? Maybe one of Unlikely. the gods? He was a god of Greece, and we did not part on good terms. And by that you mean... Which one? Yes, I see. <laughs> no shortage of bitter old ghosts in these parts. These parts being your memory, of course. Dang. Maybe his debt was to kill him? Yeah, not sure. It feels like a deep, dark therapy session. Oh, like going into the recesses yeah. of your memory. Was it familiar? It was mine. The throne I took from Ares. Oh. It is a throne of monsters. Ah, the anxiety of power made manifest. A symbol you're no doubt meant to consider. Mm -hmm. It is a symbol I reject. But maybe you're that supposed to accept it. Book on matters. Mm -hmm. A symbol can't be slain, destroyed, or ignored. The best measure is often to reclaim it, mm -hmm. redefine it. Mm -hmm. Amir, you're wise. Us, it's not the throne, it. but the god who sits in it. Mm. I don't know. Mm. Maybe. Two fights in a row now. Valhalla's demands are escalating. Oh gosh, this guy Whoa. looks badass. Oh. Oh gosh, okay, cool. I was like, you're not affecting his health at all, but 
It's going down. Watch your left. What is that? What oh, are shoes? I have flying oh, I eyeballs? Yeah, they're flying eyeballs. I think we've seen them before. Or have we? I don't mm -hmm. know. I don't remember flying eyeballs. Valhalla chose me to face me. I sense there are more challenges like it to find. That I think so. is how we earn our way forward. It's always this throne. Congratulations, old friend. You really <gasps> are going places in Valhalla. Where's Mimir? Is that really all you have to say to me? After all this time, can't Don't do it. Up so much as hello for one of your most that auspicious is, wow. victims. Hello, Helios. <laughs> Where is Mumir? How should I know? Why don't we go look for him? I don't like this head. Uh -uh. I want the other one back. Yep. Just fart on his head. <laughs> I would. <laughs> fart on his head. Yeah, I just like, <laughs> Take that. I don't like you. How's the smell back there? <laughs> Yeah, I don't like him at all. No. Like, he should not I be want, with us. I want Mimir back. <clears throat> Maybe something hit Mimir. So, what's new with you, Kratos? Mm, shut up, Helios. Heard any good pantheons lately? <laughs> Devastated any populations with the cataclysmic consequences of your actions? Turned Just on any once trusted... Ragnarok, powers. you know. You simply must bring me up to speed on your latest saga of blood-soaked vengeance. I am that no longer. You don't mean to say you've gone soft. Never believe it. Wiser, Once not a Spartan, soft. always a Spartan. No, there's no fooling me, Kratos. You know what they say? Oh, we're on the statue. You can't hide oh. in the shadows from a sun god. At least, that's what they should say. <laughs> He's got such a good voice, it's like so slimy. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't like him at all. The decor is looking a little more familiar, isn't it? A mighty chain. Auspicious sign. You've always had such luck with chains. This is all gonna work out just great for you. I can feel I wanna it. throw him. Yeah. But oh, I'm scared that he is, is. Mimir. Mimir. Oh, yeah. Sweetheart. And it's just one of those tricks. Like an illusion. It's like a test. Hmm. Now this room must really take you back. Wasn't this the chamber of sacrifice? Where you let an Athenian soldier burn to a crisp just so you could get past the room? No. Oh. Those madcap early days. Wow, we're like going all the way back. <laughs> Ugh. Oh shoot. Poor guy. Sorry. And you're like You could stay here. What, what are you doing, Kratos? You mean to sacrifice me? Again? Again? Why not? Ooh. Ah, oh, he needs to get across. Or maybe it's just to protect him. Uh. <laughs> you just put you in there for safekeeping. It's fine, oh, cool. Helios. You're making eye contact as you push me towards my demise. <laughs> what a special little personal touch. Really lets me know where I stand. Especially after such a long and agonized deliberation over what to do. Oh, how reluctant you'll tell people you were to sacrifice me to the flame. He's so annoying. Remember, he's got to do things differently. I hate to disappoint you. Blithering idiot. But you do remember I'm a sun god, right? Yeah, but you're dead. I'm afraid of a little fire. Don't threaten me with a good time, Kratos. Maybe I'll be infused with power and achieve my final form. <laughs> Maybe I'll explode and take you with me. 
Let's just see what happens. Shut Let's up. just see. I know. I'm a little bit scared of him. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. I don't think I've seen him use that before. Uh -uh. That's cool. He bringing Helios? Yeah, you have to. For another push. Let's go. Shut up. <laughs> you don't have to use your legs at all. This cage. It's not funny anymore. I can't believe you mean to roast me on a whim on a presumption that it's what Valhalla wants from you. Have you ever considered that maybe your instincts are just random thoughts that pop into your head, mm -hmm. no more likely to be true than the next? Hmm? He might have a point. That? Quickly. Make a sacrifice. Hmm. But surely making a sacrifice means giving up something that you love. Right? We don't like Helios. Just going to incinerate me and see what happens. What if well, it's the mirror? I know. Like you've been like saying. <gasps> I know it! What am I doing in here? Oh my god. No! So you gotta do some things differently. No! Oh shoot. Oh my gosh, I can't do this. No! I'm mad. Get me out of here. No, Maria, no! What is this? No! Help me! I'm trying! Please! Oh no! I knew it. Damn it! He failed. Do oh. not panic! We will simply return to the gate. Nope. I no. Don't think so. I think you've broken her Valhalla. Oh, shit. Oh. Grab him. Grab him. Yeah, grab him by the beat. I don't care. Just grab him. What the heck? Oh, his girlfriend. Yeah. Oh, no. Her wings. Oh. Yeah. She's pregnant. What? He just said you're pregnant. He said that. That's why they're upset. Remember? He got her pregnant. I missed the subtitle. I'm pretty sure. Can we rewind? She can't. On that? She can't be in there because she'll die. Yep. Oh no. Namir. Oh no. You poor thing. Look at you. You shouldn't have done that. Oh, he ill dummy. <laughs> you and Kratos would not. Really? But you're safe now. Oh. Seeking, I'm sorry. I've been so foolish, I... Later, love. <laughs> I need a moment. Damn. I don't think he could have made her pregnant. He doesn't have the working parts. Can we go back <laughs> and hear that part again? We are forever in your debt. We're gonna move forward. Will be forever in yours. That's what I heard. And now I'm like. <clears throat> you didn't hear that? Unless he's got sperm in his mouth. I'm like, where did it come from? I don't know, Wachara. It's just what I heard. <gasps> Maybe it's some uh, more of my nonsense. <laughs> I don't know. Stop. You've seen me worse. I'm not sure about that, boss. Hush. Wow. I thought she was gonna die for sure. Hold on, hold on. Go on, Kratos. Get back in there. And do what you need to do. So supportive. I thought he said... Well, that was altogether bloody terrifying. One moment I'm in a forest, the next I'm in a cage full of fire. You changed into Helios and back again. It was unpredictable. I'll um, see. Trust nothing. I'm truly not sure if we've gone too far, or if we've come too far to stop. We are not stopping. I must face this. I know, brother. I'm glad that he's got Mimir with him, though. He's not alone. I want to rewind back. 
<laughs> we'll rewind back once we're done with this, I need okay? A, I need to know, no, Chara. No, no. I need to know. I don't want to ruin the, the integrity of the story, yeah. Just hold on to that thought. What did you say about a forest? You remember being elsewhere when Helios took your place? Hi. Yes, I didn't mention that while we were plummeting, but yes, <laughs> I was in a forest, much like that of my youth. Huh. Back on my old body, too. It was a bit dreary, to be honest. Hmm. Do you wish to return there? I can't say I don't. I'm concerned, but I'm more than curious. Guess my memories are fair game in here as well. That don't would make sense. They'll just stick to the pleasant ones, will they? Nope. Unlikely. <laughs> It's a test. Mm. That's quite a new power Valhalla's conjured for you. Mm. That sword isn't something full of terrible memories, I hope. Uh, what do you think? <laughs> Probably yes is the answer. Why don't we talk about that image of you in the shrine we keep seeing? If Valhalla keeps pulling it out of your head, it must have some significance to you. Could it be that the idea of being loved and respected is a fair might better than the alternative? Mm. Now hear me out, and it's not as though I'm the smartest man alive or anything, but don't you think joining Freya's council could put you in a position to walk that path? To earn that path? Sometimes... Well, it would be a poor reason to accept. Ambition is poison. Hmm. But also sometimes the things that we want the most are the things that we're most scared of mm -hmm. having, in a way, you know? You don't feel worthy of it. Exactly. Good enough, like... Goodness. I think he killed this one before. Yeah. I think this was in four. Got it. Must keep the primordial realms up here on the top shelf. Getting back to that image of you on the shrine. I'll grant you ambition can be a poisonous motive, but your ambitions are only to help people, not for your own glory, right? Make the world a better, safer place. I think maybe that image of you is symbolic of your desire to walk a righteous path. Valhalla's little signpost. You are sure accepting Freya's offer is the right thing for me? Mm-hmm. Or for the realms. I think we are here to make sure about that. One way or the other. Mimir just doesn't give up. He's mm -hmm. like, I'm gonna keep trying ah, to convince you. Statues now. Judges, did you say? Perhaps the higher planes Judges, of Valhalla correspond to the deepest reaches of your memory. Hello, me again! Oh, if God. I must carry you, make yourself useful. Say what you see in battle. Aye, aye, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> You're also dangerously close to his asshole. Yeah, no, just saying. No, no pun intended. See what sorts of acquaintances are looking to reconnect. <laughs> Floating eyeball tentacles? No, no to this. <laughs> He's kind of funny, though. A little bit. He's starting to. This one looks easy. Nope. If easy. Oh. 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 I don't know about that. Uh oh. Oh, okay, okay. I was like, what is that? If I must carry you, be useful. Be useful. I swear. You took out Valhalla's Kratos talk. is jabby. Is jabby is Kratos. <laughs> <laughs> if you must be here, I try. At least be useful. <laughs> if you're gonna sit in my car, at least be useful. Back to the <laughs> Point out what you see on the road. Valhalla <sighs> is giving you a second chance. 
That's so funny. Well, now it's a party. Gotta love a harpy. Aye. Yay. Okay. <laughs> what wow. What are you planning to do this time, Kratos? Wait, no, don't tell me. The suspense is honestly the only thing keeping me awake. Up. <laughs> You're giving me like like I'm feeling like some type of way about you. I know, he's so annoying. Like you're making me feel un like He's like he's like a passenger in your car that you agreed to give a ride to, but then you're like, I really regret this. Yeah. Whoa. Let me guess. But they're eyeball. Nice. Got it. Hey, miss. Miss. Whoa. Yeah, I hit them with a big sword. Uh oh. Oh, no shit. Oh, now, now, now you're on our side? Yeah. Cool. Oh, we. Uh oh. Maybe have one of those try to hit you, but hit him. Yeah, he's gonna just make it. Maybe. Hit Maybe the not. other ones. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. This just fell off. Oh, he's destroying. Yeah. I feel kind of bad for it. Here we are. Let's see what brilliant move you thought of. Shut up. We would throw you in there, but we know that's, mm, that's no bueno. What to sacrifice, though? Sacrifice yourself. Mm. Um, Kratos? <laughs> Surely you're not supposed to. It's, yeah, what you're comfortable with, I guess. I don't know. I'd like to see this. Wow. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Are we back outside now? Yep. Where's my mirror? We're not back outside. Brother? Oh, yeah, we're still Me inside, too. I guess. Oh. Nice. Where are we now? Oh! Tear. Hi, Tear. What's up? Like, the real, the tier. real tier? The invitation was yours. Oh. I would have signed it. But it was important you come here for your own reasons. Then you're not an illusion. You're in the flesh, old friend. And you're not Odin. What do you want? Finally get to re meet the real one. Yeah. That's nice. I know what you're wrestling with, Spartan. Mm. I understand it better than you realize. Really? The shame. Well, he's the been doubt. there, remember? Mm. The question. I could find no answer for until I came here. Lifetimes ago. Stepped through that door. What is in there? Oh. I'm not here to spoil that for you. <laughs> Only to help you prepare. All right. Why? Mm. Because I can. Because for us, Fighting occupies the body while our minds work out the rest. Oh, let's go fight him. Because. Maybe it's. Yeah. You're not ready. No, I don't think no. he's Odin. Yet. It's training. Maybe. All right. Here we go. Oh, man, you gotta kill the nice guy. Show me. Hey, you don't have to kill, just Why defeat. Exactly you know what? Consider Maybe. It a kind of trial by combat, Mimir. When Kratos can get the better of him, we'll know his mind has done the work. Ah. Uh, <laughs> occupy the body so the mind can work out the rest. Good. Expect nothing less. 
Okay. Dang, this looks like it would probably be a really long fight. He is impatient, emotional, easily surprised. A man at one with himself has a clearer mind, sharper instincts. True. That man is ready to win. That man is ready to progress. Fighting is his meditation. <laughs> this is why. On your guard. Of Olympian power. Oh, so close, so close. Defend yourself. Maybe you should defend yourself here. Whoa. <laughs> Ooh. Well done, Kratos. I yield. Oh. Good then. Okay. Good then. What did you learn? Yeah. Dang, he's so tall. He's huge. Oh yeah, he's a giant. Perhaps you are ready now. Am I? Honestly, nobody can truly say that but you. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. All right. opens. No songs this time. Oh no. Relax your mind. I am not ready. Yet. But we will get you there. Ooh. Interesting. Like the trauma is too the strong. Is yourself. Yeah. God. We've never seen anyone engage Valhalla quite the way you have. Zigrun. How fares your journey? We have uncovered our host. It is Tyr. Tyr, you say? Aye. And no projection either. I never knew his connection to Valhalla was so strong. But then, he goes back further than I do. Fascinating. <laughs> Check me out, baby girl. <laughs> He's like, yeah. Kratos, glad to see you're back inside. We made it. it seems Valhalla has arranged something special for you in the throne room. See you again soon, Kratos. Hmm. <clears throat> it's like therapy when they say you're doing I the work. Do this. Um. You remember this, Kratos. The memory is vivid. A familiar scene to any that know your legend. A man at the crossroads of a fateful decision. Yeah. Aye, you've spoken of this, brother. The pact you made with Ares to stave off the barbarian war. Day I sold my soul to a god of war. Why show me this? Well, if I had to guess, probably to make you feel like the piece of shit you are. <gasps> Is he necessary? <laughs> no part of my design. Is either Valhalla's or yours. <sighs> At least he hasn't replaced me again. Not yet, anyway. <laughs> Seems a real charmer. <laughs> Maybe mm. he's like that that voice inside your head that tells you all the bad things you don't want to hear. Yeah. Memory fragment of your time in Alfheim, then. Tell me, who was Kratos of Sparta the day you made your pledge to Ares? Oh. I was the youngest captain in the Spartan army. I had gained a reputation for my skills in combat, my command on the battlefield, but also my aggression. I was determined to never lose, and until then, never had. My men were loyal. Fiercely so. How many Spartans did you command? Not enough that day. How many barbarians did you face? Too many. Thousands. 
Great leader. Here. Why help prepare me to take your old position? Why not fulfill it yourself? You seem capable. He retired. To the mortals of these realms, I am an ancient myth, long out of mind. The days I could hope to unify these realms are long past. But they see you as the hero of Ragnarok. You are known and respected. Mm -hmm. And from what I have seen, you're the most qualified by far. You need only be ready. Are you ready? I'm back! What a thrill! Who <laughs> yes. I'm not thrilled. <laughs> I'm back I with the thrill. It's genuinely hard to think of anything stupider than pledging your soul to Ares of all people. <laughs> I mean, any of Zeus's brood are bound to be garbage. Present company by no means excluded. <laughs> but Ares gonna say. made a real art out of being vicious and depraved. Though, I suppose I can't begrudge you your role model. <laughs> I see you still use the blades he gave you. Can you really say you regret a decision? and still keep benefiting from the trappings of that decision? I'm not I, sure, I'm just asking. I think it's okay. Have I you ever tried to do the math on how many people died as a result of your little collaboration? Like Thank you. Contemplating the grains Remind of me of the past. The beaches, yeah, it? past is past. Overwhelming, honestly. We, we've moved on. You don't know what I've done right now. It's like someone you know? left you a party favor. Yeah, there. what we have done. Oh, and it's a symbolic totem of your shame. That's so thoughtful. <laughs> He's the worst. You're being judged. <laughs> and we all know your past actions wouldn't pass muster with anybody. Oh, I meant to ask. How did you like setting yourself on fire? Truly entertaining stuff. Sorry to miss how it ended up. No, do you want to try next time? You still have some ash on your skin. Am I crazy? Shut up. <laughs> Siren? Cover my ears! Kratos! Nope. Huh. Making quick work of this guy. Mm. Uh oh, oh, I'm just upgraded. And stay dead. Watch out. Now you're on our side. Yeesh. She's scary. Yeah. Oh no, oh, he no. died. Ah, see? I worry when I'm not there to watch your back. Yeah, Helio sucks, that's why. Yeah. He's rubbish. He's in the head. <laughs> He's no good at, like, telling you when stuff is coming behind is you. A key. Huh. From my past. Did it unlock something important? Only a memory. Seems Valhalla thinks you have a story to tell. Later. What about them now? Yeah, I want to know now. Do you yet wish to speak about Sigrun? She was eager to receive you mere days ago. What has changed? Oh, don't Enough about me. To be Let's talk about you. My romantic life, brother. <laughs> I am interested. And you are evading the question. Yes. Here we go. I'm gonna find well, out. Spill the tea. After you dropped me off at a longhouse the other night, Sigrun made a cowberry and hazelnut pudding. Sounds First delightful. I don't eat anymore, so slightly awkward, but a lovely thought. And? Pretty much it, really. Whatever. There is more to this. <gasps> what else happened that night between you and Sigrun? Well, we stayed up much too late. I told her stories, she told me secrets. She put spirits to my lips, even though I can't get drunk. Then she invited me to watch her fall asleep. Oh, that's cute. Mm. And the next morning? The next morning we took a boat along the Lake of Nine. It was divine, brother. The lake was sun-dappled, the air was crisp and perfect. You could smell the thaw. When did you misspeak? You know me too well, brother. <laughs> you spoke too much. We were on the lake when I put my metaphorical foot in it. Mm. Okay, what did you say? 
Come on. We need to know. Push the door so we can hear the story. <laughs> and? Come on, Kratos. That was it? That's it, just... Where? Oh. Tell me. What happened between you and Sigmund? Thank you. Well, she was rowing past where you found her family treasury. Where we learned she cursed her brother over forbidden love. That's right. And as we rode by, I remember feeling grateful. The place was now deep underwater where she couldn't see it. Oh, so you mentioned it. At that it. moment, she turned to me and she said, I think, Mamiya, I might be smitten with you. Oh. I think maybe I want to kiss you. Ooh. Hmm. And then? Hmm. Indeed, brother. I mean, there's always been more to us than there's been the opportunity to explore. So much unspoken beneath the surface. But hard to name it so boldly. Uh, I do. And then? Did you guys kiss? Like, what happened? I'll tell you. Kratos, the key you found. Who oh, was it? Let's put a pin in it. Did it unlock? It belonged to a boat captain I met during a battle on the Aegean Sea. His ship was part of a fleet under attack by a Hydra. Mm, I remember that. locked his quarters, where I heard women screaming for help. Ah, yes. The story of your fight with the three-headed sea serpent. You impaled one of its heads on the ship's mast, was it? Yes. But that battle is not why this key appeared. The killing of the boat captain, Point. That seems to follow me wherever I go. So they want us to know his, the full story yet? Hello again, Kratos! <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Every time we're having a nice time, Helios shows up. <laughs> yep. They don't want us to finish the Mimir story yet. If they don't finish the story by the time this game is over, I'm gonna be a little bit upset. I need to know what he said. She's pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Kristen. I don't know. Wait, well, you know, maybe this is made magically. <laughs> oh, sure. Maybe he thought it. And like, I don't know magically, like. I don't know, Chara. Like Zeus and Athena. Like he just thought it, and then boom, she appeared. Yes. Finally. Get on back to the start and ascend, or whatever it is. Oh. Four or four, is this it? Are we done? No. With this? No. Oh. oh. I'm back, brother. Thank God, Mimir. Well done, Kratos. I brought something else to keep things interesting. You're not the only one with Ooh. weapons from far off lands, you know. Mm. Ready? Oh, Maybe. that's cool. I like that thing. Training again. That thing looks really heavy, that weapon. Whoa. Those who have fallen. Look out! Tia's using them to heal! Why did oh, you do dear. it, Kratos? Why did you pledge yourself to Ares? Yeah. I was ambitious. Proud. I could not accept defeat. I crave power. Is that all? Are you sure? Nothing more to that story? Nothing else under the surface? There's got to be more. Yeah. Come on. Dig deep, bro. I lost focus that time. Ooh. I lost focus that time. Get him. Ouch. Do you yield? Yep. I yield. I yield, Kratos. <laughs> We're like, good, 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 Very good. Well. Yeah. Yes. Very well. Every time. His hair got a little messed up. I believe you found an understanding within yourself. Shall we see? Pools. It's not only memories. Indeed. For what is a memory apart from our perspective on it? That's true. You know the evils that came of your path. You know the evils within yourself. Yes, these you dwell on. But it's not that simple, is it? The horde is fast, brother. What would have happened if you didn't stop it? Our lands would have been overrun. Our people killed. 
violated. He did people, save his people army too. Was sworn to yeah. protect. An army led by you. Did you not feel a duty to fulfill your purpose? Did you not fear for the safety of your homeland? You saved them. You would excuse my actions. Excusing them is not the exercise, Kratos. Only accepting them. This. Accepting that you yeah. acted based on what you knew then, not on what was to come. Oh my God. Your motivation and their consequences are far more complicated than you let yourself believe. Wow. Yeah. I think perhaps you have more to process. I think mm. so. Yes. I have much to think about. I will return. Mm. And that I will be waiting. Deep. Yeah. It's so true, though. Oh dear. Hmm. Oh. Yes. And look, I think Kratos may have survived that time. So it's Tyr's game you're playing? This is all his idea? Mm. The game is not his purpose. There is something here I must see through. And what is that exactly? A process. <sighs> all right. If it's helping, I trust you both. We all do. As we trust in Valhalla. Even after what it did to you? I knew the rules and chose to break them. I regret nothing. Aww. I did that for you, Mimir. Mm -hmm. I will hear. I wasn't born with the privilege of some of my sisters in arms. I wasn't bred for greatness. I was just the daughter of some poor innkeeper. Matter of fact, I wasn't even his. He just raised me after somebody left me there. Aww. I didn't have much going for me. But I had one thing. I wasn't afraid of anyone. If somebody was asking for a punch in the face, I never thought twice. Respect. I of trouble on myself that way, it's true. But I sure learned how to fight. Enough for now. I'll pick that up later. <laughs> All right. Speaking of stories, Mimir. In, I yeah. This process is working for you somehow. Yes. Succeed or fail. I feel progress. Clarity. I need to see it through. Okay. Very good problem. An infamous act. One they still spoke of in the years of rebuilding. I somehow doubted they meant it so little. I'll give you this, brother. Your technique has improved immeasurably. I needed his power to secure my vengeance against the gods. I believed I had no choice. No choice? You could have not ripped my head off my body. That was absolutely an option. Sure. And he's back. Yeah, we all hate him. That's fine. Was it Kratos? Killing me deprived Greece of the sun. They were plunged into perpetual cold and darkness. Crops ceased to grow. Famine descended on our homeland. Okay. Enough. He is better, isn't he? Mm -hmm. That would be. I don't blame him. <laughs> yeah. You did chop his head off. <laughs> Your technique has improved. <laughs> Kratos. It's a lot cleaner now. Yeah. Your decision to behead Helios, was it fueled by any personal motivation? Was it really it was not personal. I did know him long before I killed him. Mm. He was as insufferable as any god. <laughs> His death brought me no satisfaction. Did you know what would happen as a result? No. When Helios was captured by the god of dreams, the lands fell into darkness and were not restored until his return. I knew exactly what oh. would happen. Oh. But he did it anyway. It's interesting we're making positives out of this. Yeah. Kratos, no, there's like... I hope you'll forgive me for overhearing. But before you first found your way to me, you were grappling with the symbolism of your former seat of power. May I offer a perspective? Sure, Tyr. Before I became God of War, I felt as hesitant as you. I feared that taking the throne would invalidate Odin's power hierarchy. 
which even then I didn't trust. But I decided I could wield a better influence on the inside than on the outside. Mm -hmm. There are many ways to lead, but not all of them involve ruling. The throne and the office are only what you bring to them. Mm. Yeah. Dear, earlier you spoke to me as though I seek to lead, as if I were someone to be followed. Your self-criticism, valid and otherwise, seem well reflected here in Valhalla. It's no accident that your mind manifested that throne. Mm, because he's thinking More about it, simple. yeah. It's a challenge to revisit your assumption. Mm. The mirror's right. You have the power, and I think the wisdom, to redefine what it means to you. To assert that power is to prove to yourself that the chair doesn't change you. It doesn't make you a new person. Not if you know who you are and why you serve. Know thyself. Master thyself. Know thy yep. Oh. Yeah. This is the tree, right? The mirror was, was that? Oh yeah. Right? Yeah, I think so. The one that he was trapped inside, yeah. Oh. Oh, here we go again. Oh. Oh. Son of Thor on your memory of all things. Yeah. We don't want that memory. Guess you're not done with me yet, Kratos. Oh my god. I'm back. And lest we forget, Kratos, lest we neglect to place your deed in full and proper context, <laughs> I saved your life. Me! And you literally tore off my head for my troubles. Imagine if all your new friends knew how you used to treat your old friends. Of course, you're not the same man, right? Far easier to blame others that way. Am I right? God. I know you are a projection He's of mind, insufferable. But for what it is worth, the death I gave you wasn't just. Aww. Oh, how touching. Yeah. It's not actually worth the spittle it took to mumble that out. You're do so rude. Do, do not Nobody do it again. Wants to hear that from you. <laughs> the man apologized. <laughs> He's like, I mean, him. he uh, is gone. I truly hope it brings you unrelenting <laughs> torment. It's mm. changing. Chills you just a little when they do that, doesn't it? Feels like. Judgment. Good, judge me. There we go. Ooh. Now we'll see half a man. <laughs> yeah, whatever, Helios, you're just ahead. Are you confused? Woo! Come on. That's it. You open the way forward with your blood soaked and savage ways. Oh, hello, brother. I'm back. Kratos, I've been awaiting your return. I have another cherished weapon from my travels to show you. What hmm. we got? Ready to see. Whoa. Those are pretty cool. Mm. Time to grab yours out. Wow. <laughs> Tears out here with like different weapons. Meanwhile, Kratos is like, oh, I'll just stick to my trusty spear. Having fun yet. Yep, lots of fun. Nope. <laughs> oh no. How did it feel to plunge your homeland into darkness? I did not intend the land to suffer, but I was indifferent, consumed only by rage and retribution. That is not what I asked. 
How did it feel? In that moment, your soul given over to darkness, bringing a darkness over everything you could see. It felt true. Hmm. The outside oh. reflected his inside. Find the light. Are you ready to win? Show me. Oh. Come. Show me that spark grit. Come on now. Be a Spartan. Get out of the darkness, brother. Whoa. He just popped up out of nowhere. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, so close. Come on. Yield. Do you yield? <laughs> Every time. I yield. I yield. <laughs> Thanks, Tio. Good then. <laughs> and every time. Yeah. <laughs> no, it saves on, you know, the 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 rendering. You just use the I same ending every time. I think you were different, Kratos. I think you were hurt. Deeply hurt. And you handled it unskillfully. Oh. This guy is so wise. I know. Wait. This is, is like you restoring the sun? when I do therapy. You do chariot <sighs> My therapist the is like, let me reframe sky. that for you. But sacrificed yourself in the process. Yes. I fell to my death and was saved by Helios. Mm. But this memory happened before I killed him. My evils were yet to come. What is the point? That your legacy has always been a complicated one. Mm. That goodness is not a destination we arrive at, but a practice. That's oh, Misfortune deep. may drive anyone to darkness. We resist it only through wisdom and vigilance. Wow. You are not so unskillful now as you were then. Wow. Better voices in your head, you might call it. Wow. I think that's enough for now. You have much to contemplate. Yeah. Yes. Back to the beach then. <laughs> you should be proud of your progress, Kratos. See you soon. Same time next week. Yeah, this is like deep. It's really deep. Like all this time we're being told of all his bads and Well, it's also because that's what he believes yeah. himself to be. That's what he sees. Yeah, he only sees the bad. The bad Which and is the darkness. Interesting because that means it seems like you're making progress. Whatever you're doing in there. He feels Perhaps. bad through yeah. all that. Listen, I So he was never really was. No, I made you feel like we expected more of you than you could give. And I just want you to know, I'm not asking you to change how you are or who you are. We had to break the old world to build a new one. Picking up the pieces and putting them together stronger. It's a rare opportunity. You made a difference here. In some circles, a symbol of change. On many days, just knowing that you're a part of the council is enough. And other days. You've earned a voice. How you use it is up to you. Okay. Sigrun, inside we encountered a son of Thor. It wouldn't really be him in there, I can assure you. <laughs> he you didn't make it. You have a memory of a past fight, and I'm sure Valhalla takes advantage. But why him? I don't think that's for Did me you feel to bad about it? Yeah. Well, something for us to ponder in between melees. Feels bad about, about it. I think so. Air. Use this. There is a secret weapon that turns challenges into triumph. Hmm. And that is your ability to adapt. Continue. Early in my life, before I was a Valkyrie, I was a healer in a small village. My father trained me in the use of herbs and natural remedies. Oh. To him, coming from a long line of herbal healers, that was the only true medicine. But visiting the city, I saw healers who used magic. Only magic to treat their patients. I'd seen it work. And work wonders. I tried to tell my father, but he said mage healing was against his philosophy. A dangerous shortcut that violated tradition. Being a good daughter, 
I respected his convictions. But then? But that all changed when he took ill. Mm -hmm. That's a good place to stop for now. Dang it! When you're further along on your journey, I'll share the next part of my story. Ugh, I'm tired of tired of this <laughs> waiting. Please accept this. It's like just finish Keep the story. Those limitations, General. Back to my story. Yes. I will hear. So there I was, little Miss Brawl Magnet. If I wasn't starting the fight, I was the first one charging in to join it. Maybe it's something in the Asgard water, but it seemed like there was always a fight to be had. I guess I needed the rush, something to keep me sharp, feeling alive. I was driven without fear or frankly much sense to hold me back. Got myself a bit of a reputation, and that ended up being a problem. This notorious bully I'd humiliated held on to a grudge and tried to track me down. Found out way too easily who I was and where I lived. Set out to teach me a lesson. We'll pick it up there when you progress further. <clears throat> we still need Mimir's story. I know. <sighs> it's like, what happened, Mimir? How did you piss her off? Yeah. Mm. Oh. Is that Pandora? Mm-hmm. A substitute daughter. A box full of evils. This one feels important. Hmm. This is your blacksmith's story, isn't it? His girl was the key. And he died protecting her? Protecting her from me. I opened that box. Oh, you remember. To kill Ares. And what I released. Pretty much turned all the gods crazy. <laughs> and he's back. Quiet head. Unfortunate. The time I spend in my own Valhalla means you get more time with him. <laughs> yeah. Kratos, how well did you know the blacksmith's daughter? Pandora. She reminded me of my own daughter, who I lost long ago. That's right. Sorry. Even at your most vengeful, you must not have wanted to see harm come to her. That's true. Pandora was innocent. The way she saw things, she could reach me when few could. She deserved better than to be a pawn, sacrificed in a game of gods. Your regret is palpable. But thank you for letting yourself remember. That is important. Yeah. You and Sigrun. I am still waiting for the part So were spoke. we! In my so defense, were we! I only told her the truth because it struck me in the moment. Okay. I told her my feelings for her were deep as Rand's Hall and had been for as long as I'd known her. But just then a kind of revelation came over me. Oh god. A sudden cold clarity that it was vanity to imagine that I, as I am, could be enough for her as she is. Oh. So I had myself tell her that I didn't think I could give her what she needed. Now, I am mad at you. I won, brother. <laughs> so <laughs> dumb, okay. Yeah. yeah. If you needed his Aww. key to save others, why does it seem to bother you so? Your actions in this case seem justified. The captain was swallowed by the Hydra before I was able to kill it. Then I entered its maw to retrieve the key. The captain had somehow survived. Yeah. Going over a fall that would surely kill him. I saw the terror in his eyes as he fought to hold on. And in relief, when he believed I would save him. Instead, I took the key and dropped him to his death. Yeah, that was savage. And mm. it was all for nothing. The women were dead. Sorry, brother, but maybe we reserve our talks for safe spaces. Agreed. For safe spaces. Like, we fight now. Yeah. Be on a guard. Brother, you've told me many times of mortals you killed when in the gods' service. I think about this boat captain. Yeah, it why cost him? Me nothing to show him mercy. His life was in the hands. To be so casually cruel. I... He regrets this man it. Did nothing to me. And I treated his life as nothing. He was not a god who would manipulate me more from his service. I cannot hide without my thirst for revenge. He was just a man, afraid for his life. Attacked and swallowed by a monster he had no hope of defeating. Mm. But the Hydra was just an animal. 
I showed him what a true monster looked like. Wow. That one hurt. Yeah. Where is Freya? It's a lot of regret. Right for the moment. As you know, she's attending to many things presently. Yeah, she's a busy lady. Establishing a new governing body for the realms is no simple task. There are leaders to find and recruit, negotiations for sharing power. I'm sure she'd prefer to be here, but you'll have to make do with the three of us for now. I'm sure we're in excellent hands. Yeah, suck up, Mimu. <laughs> You've earned this. Valhalla recognizes your determination. Let it empower you as you evolve. I'll tell you more of my story now, if you care to hear it. Yes. You may speak. If you remember, my father had fallen ill. It was bad. An illness unknown to us. I offered to fetch the mage healer from the city, but my father refused. He insisted herbs were the only way to help him. You can guess what happened next. Yep. He was gone before the spring. I was devastated. In time, I grew to hate my father's philosophy and dedicated myself to healing through magic. It was a blind rejection of an entire field. Because I believed it failed my father. Because I blamed his death on his faith. The truth is, I traded one limiting perspective for another, but I wasn't ready to see that yet. Hmm. That's a good place to stop for now. So you know how to do both now. Yeah, that's very insightful though. And more like a dream it all seems. Which is ironic. Back then in my youth, I could hardly bear to sleep. Then, with time, I came to value a proper night's rest. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? In captivity, it was nearly the only escape I knew. And then the need to sleep went away completely. And I don't miss the time you lost. Damn it, brother. I do miss dreaming. Hmm. The mind comes to terms with itself in ways only possible with your waking judgment out of the way. Huh. Yeah, that's our true. desires, our anxieties, like a bifrost window to what's going on in your soul. And Valhalla does the same. Aye. And I don't think I realized how much I needed it. Hmm. My last dream, I dreamt of a dog. What's that mean? You're gonna get a puppy? <laughs> I wish. <laughs> oh god. Oh, here oh. We go. Why are you back? Yeah, the guilt. Yep. Why we feel so bad here? The cycle. Mm -hmm. I'm back to brighten your day. <laughs> no. All your righteous haranguing about how evil the gods are, and you somehow gloss over that little extra nudge you gave them. Uh. Opening the box for some people did not know the consequences. You know who would claim ignorance this of guy. the consequences of trusting Athena? Is that your idea of a joke, Kratos? Because <laughs> I admit it's hilarious. I feel like he could be a, be like real, a good Kratos. comedian. Whether you should <laughs> have clown. suspected the consequences or not, you certainly can't claim that you would have cared about them. You wanted the power He's to like kill the devil, Kratos. right? Yeah, and I feel like he's just it, all of his worst thoughts about himself yes. personified. Like he's like the, the fallen angel, and then Ramirez like the good you angel. Like, yeah, and so is uh, of solemn what's his name? Uh, Tear. Tear. A trusted figure. A worship figure. I think he's got both of them on his shoulder. I feel like. Absolute yeah. All of you to let yourself consider such a thing. But he's like a past reflection. I guess irony can have you when it earns you. Something. So you're sorry to him. Oh well, you did. Yeah, he but. did. He didn't accept it. <laughs> no, that's true. Yeah. Just say sorry again. Now I feel like Helios is more like oh, ego. Oh, you know. I don't think you can be trusted to keep that safe at all. Hmm. Pretty sure he agrees with me. Hmm. No. Whatever. We're not gonna listen to you, Helios. Back 
again. Another lesson. Still not used to that. Oh, he's well glowing. Done, last lesson. Did he I get one last yep. weapon to show you? Oh, good. I think you'll enjoy it. If that's the word. What? Ooh. Is that a katana? Get it. Be ready. Oh, he heals fairly quickly. Yeah. Yeesh. Come on. Get out of the way. Okay. Take that. Yeah, now the other minions will come. You told me of the fear and hatred you released when you opened that box. Whoa. I remember. If what I ask you to remember is what was left behind. Complete, Complete the story. The story. Yeah. Come on, Kratos. Be honest. Ready to win? Show me. Boom, Hookson. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Uh oh. But it's almost symbolic, I feel like. He's split it into two. Yeah. Boom, Hookson. Find your watchers. Thanks, Mimir. Mimir's so helpful. Yeah. I love him. Mm. Nice. Oh, that, that weapon again. Uh huh. One more hit. Come on. Okay, never mind. He just got some more life. Come on. We got Go. him. We got him. I yield. Stop, Kratos. I yield. Mm. Hard fought. Oh, it's slightly different this time. Even his saying was. Yeah. <laughs> this is it. You're ready, Kratos. Let's see what your mind has worked out. When the evils of the box were purged, what remained was hope, mm. which you chose to release back to the world. Yes. After everything, you came back full circle to sacrificing yourself. Yeah. My death would have been just, but it was not to be. Yes, you lived, and hope still lived inside you from that day to this one. One might say you brought hope back to these realms after a long slumber. Box or no box, Kratos. Hope and fear and love and hate exist in every one of us. The question is, which will you choose to let guide your actions? Yes. Each choice we make shapes our world. Mm. I see the truth of it. And mm. I believe I am ready to walk through that door. Let's see what's on the other side. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, oh this is me. <laughs> That's the secret password. Hey, hey come on, you're ready. <laughs> you're like, hey, hey, <laughs> go. <laughs> you didn't do all that work for nothing, okay? Just walk through. Oh. oh. Conversation with your... Younger self. Oh, how interesting. The two split. I remember how it felt to take that throne. All that it meant. Is he going to talk back? And all that it did not. A god of war. God of pain. Oh. Of suffering. A 
destruction. And Owen said I chase redemption that I know I can never deserve. You're a good what person. does that make me? A god of fools. A god of... Humanity, perhaps? Oh, you have to forgive him because he is you. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. But now should I this same man? Should I sit, take, proclaim, lead? Place myself in service. In That's it. In service. service, in service of the people. Should I lose everything and everyone? There's to be enough left inside so that I do not become you. Gonna sit on the throne once more. Oh man. But this time, he's ready. In service. Mm -hmm. It was a private moment, Amir. <laughs> Did you find what you needed? Hmm. Glad to hear it, brother. Well done here, then. So, uh, what now? No. We be the god of war. I believe. I would like to sit here for a while. Wow. Oh. I thought it was a commercial for a sec. Yeah. I was like, what just happened? It's a weird transition. He's ready. Yep. Where's everyone? Get the 
final story. Well done, General. I had no doubt you would see this through to the end. I hope Valhalla gave you everything you need. Yep. Look who's returning from the front gate for once. Something must have happened in there. I take it this Rhea. is a good... I will join you. I will try to be what the people need. Good. I'm very pleased to hear that. And that you found what you needed here. I could not have done so without my friends. I am grateful. Valhalla is at your disposal, Kratos. If you have more you wish to work out now or later, we will heed the call. <laughs> you can come back anytime. Mm -hmm. That was an interesting little uh, DLC. So, okay, maybe he didn't say she was pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> do you still want to check that I out? I do. I do. Okay, wanna, okay. I, I do want to hear it. Okay. Okay. Real quick. Real quick. I do want to hear it. I'm gonna. I want to hear it one more it. time to see if you hear what I heard. <laughs> Even though I think I miss, I misheard, but for some reason. Okay. Here she comes. Let's get you out of here, Sigrun. You're burning. You're burning. Okay. Here. It was his accent. You're burning. <laughs> it's not like you're bad. You're pregnant. Like to me, I like I heard something else. I knew you were crazy. I was like, there is no way that Mimir made her pregnant. First of all, he's dead. Secondly, he doesn't have the working body parts. I didn't say what I said made sense. <laughs> all I said is I heard it's his damn accent. Okay, Ochara. <laughs> I heard something else, and I didn't read the words. I missed it. Uh, whatever, guys. Okay. Crucify so, me again. <laughs> no, you're 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 amusing. It's fine. No, I I enjoyed that. I think like just in terms of watching the cutscenes or whatever, it did yeah. get a little bit repetitive yes. over time because it, it, it is. I mean, it, you're you're just going through the game and you're like getting more skills along the way. So mm -hmm. I imagine it's it probably feels a lot more <laughs> fulfilling and frustrating as you're yeah. playing it because like you'll die and you'll come back and, and, and you're like ah oh, I gotta start again. Yeah, and that's the whole point point right but i think the the story that they were telling and the the messaging especially for him was really really strong because you know having seen his story from the first game all the way to ragnarok it's like he's gone through a lot yeah you know and it, i i really love how powerful this was and how meaningful yeah it was and i love how they just changed everything to let him see himself in another light because yeah. sometimes all we see is the bad in us right yeah that's what we fix saying we forget the good and it was kind of cool to see them kind of reflect why did you do that would you feel though yeah exactly were you pleased no were you happy no why did you do this oh it was to protect these people did you know this had a consequence yes but why did you do it anyways because you saw something else you know what i mean so i felt and then he tried to restore things and then he sacrificed himself for the people over and over and over again which is why now we know why his life was given back to him so many times yeah and how, why and how he was able to cheat death so many times and that's kind of cool yeah, no, I and, it. and I think like it, you know, when you think back to the other games, you know, he he had a real issue with the gods because ultimately he became a god and he hated gods and thus he hated yes. himself. And so there's a lot of self-hatred that you mm -hmm. see, especially towards the younger version of himself that acted differently, that was more arrogant, perhaps, and more yep. violent and just kind of went off of instinct maybe more so than the older man he is now and just kind of realizing and accepting that that person is him mm -hmm. right but also he has a greater purpose yeah he has a greater purpose and he's become think, he's become wiser you yes know? he's be become older and with age comes experience and with experience comes wisdom Yep. You know, and even if he didn't realize it then, but I think the gods deep down also could see, even though they were using him to toy with him. Yeah. I feel like deep down, they also saw past all that, like all the evil. Well, they saw the potential. I think in they him. saw the potential and they wanted to almost like morph him, but then they also tried to stray him away by toying with him. 
You know what I mean? In, I, a, in a sense. Honestly, when it comes to the Greek gods, like I feel like they were just using him. But he's now. They were, but I in, think they uh, they were also trying to train him in some shape or form because they wanted him to work for them, basically. Yeah, you know exactly. what I mean? And they that's saw, what I'm saying. They saw potential in him and then and they then used he kept, him. Yes, but the but, but the beautiful part about that is interesting because in a way they wanted they were training him. But for their own purpose. Yeah, for their then, own gain. And yeah. their own gain. And then he betrayed them every time. Or, you know, fought against them or yeah. whatever. And ended up going the opposite route every moment they felt like, I gotcha. Right, you yeah, because I mean? he, was, he so... was constantly making choices, mm -hmm. right? Which is ultimately what it comes down to. Like what Tyr said, you know, it's like all of these different things exist within us. You know, whether yeah. that's like love, hate, anger, all of it but we can make a choice every day to choose which thing which feeling we're which going path. to be led yeah. by you know so it's a, it's consistently a choice with. yeah that yeah. was really powerful i thought that was really 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 cool yeah I, it was very wise and it was very deep and that was i didn't expect them to go get so deep and i was like whoa and i'm like listening yeah 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 yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I tell mean, me more <laughs> i think uh, for me i think the biggest takeaway is to remember obviously when we look back at our past mm -hmm. it's easy to judge ourselves mm -hmm. and to be like god why wasn't i better why didn't i make better choices and it's like you only know what you knew then yes right like and so when you, you can only do so much exactly and when you look back at it as an older wiser more experienced person you have to have compassion for the person that you were and to kind of accept that, you yeah. know, and, and, and not hate yourself for the mistakes that you made. Because mm -hmm. ultimately, I mean, they, they did bring you to where you are now. And so you can use all of that experience to then, you know, make better choices mm -hmm. in the future. And I thought that was really great. No, I really liked it. It was definitely a huge growing moment in self-reflection. Yeah. And it's kind of interesting because we always get into that. We get we have that saying, there's always two sides to every story. Yes. Which is interesting because there's two sides to every story within us as well. The good and the bad and the purpose and like the reasoning behind things and like the reality of things. Like it, it's interesting. Well, yeah. And like your memories, they're, yep. they're just... Sometimes a, we, a reflection of what you're kind of feeling and sometimes mm -hmm. like it's not entirely the true truth. and so that was really cool like Tyr was a really great therapist yeah <laughs> he's all now like now we know why on. I'm glad we got to meet the real Tyr yeah right <laughs> because he is way wiser and like cooler than anything yeah he's way cooler than yeah. Odin for sure oh um, yeah yeah this was great this was just yeah. like a really emotional like little dlc and like a really nice way to wrap up kratos's story i mm -hmm. heard somewhere actually or i saw a little uh youtube short where someone was talking about a leak where they are going to be making another god of war ah. but this time it's going to be focused on atreus of course so yeah this is like a nice little wrap up for for kratos and it's like okay kratos Kratos, Old you man did your, Kratos you going did out your man. there. You did, your, you did your job. Yeah. Now he's out there saving the world. Just like, you know, rebuilding the world yeah. with Freya. And that's a really great place for him to be and a really great thing for him to do. So appreciate that. Anyway, thank you guys for joining us on this wonderful journey. And uh, let us know what else you would like us to watch. And we will gladly do that. In the meantime, go give Kristen a follow on her social media and like subscribe and stuff here. Say I'm Achara Kirk. <laughs> this is Kristen Sevespino. Ciao.